Good morning. Good morning. It's three o'clock <laughs> in the afternoon, but we have new creamers to try, including, uh, well, I guess I was gonna say breakfast creamers because Pop-Tarts, but Twix is not really a breakfast. Dessert. Breakfast, if you're an adult, you do what you want, <laughs> responsibly. I suppose we should share in each cream one well, I drink creamer. I'm gonna let you do the pouring because I drink black coffee, so I don't know how you psychopath people put 75% cream and 25% coffee. <laughs> so I'm gonna let you do the creamer aspect though, knowing that you're probably Perfect. using as much cream as the average American. Okay. America. <laughs> what do you yeah, you start with pop tarts since it's breakfast, quote unquote? Okay. You want me to? Start with pop tarts. We've already popped the seal off of these for the sake of the video. We have not tasted them though, so. Ooh. It smells very concentrated. You wanna? Am I going first? Yeah, you, cause you're the coffee cream connoisseur. I like it. Yeah, does it taste like? It's very subtle. But I also didn't. Two. More creamer. Yeah, it's actually really good. Um, I mean, it tastes like a you know a Starbucks drink. That, I guess I like that's the closest that I would get to like a, but it's a not super like sweet, a overly sweet. Yeah, it's really not. Um, we but do drink dark coffee, so mm -hmm. um, shout out Vigilante Coffee Company. I I would drink it again. I'm trying to, <clears throat> I'm trying to choke on it. I'm trying to judge the pop tartiness of like, here, there's a little spilled. Let me try. Now it's gonna be too much. <laughs> um, but it does taste like brown sugar pop tart. Yeah. Very, yeah. very subtle, but. Yeah, it does. It's but like the brown sugar pop tarts are very subtle too. Mm -hmm. So it kind of it jives. Um, yeah, I, I dig it. If it was all, if the ground was made of Pop-Tarts and I had to make a hole, I would dig it. And I dig it. That made a lot of sense. Twix. Now this is zero sugar. Um, I, don't know. I don't mind zero sugar. It's, it is what it is. We're gonna die of something. It smells like caramel. I smell, I smell the caramel, yeah. yeah. Now, gonna assume that because these are both coffee mate right brand yeah so they're probably going to use the same flavor ingredients for the breadiness of like the crispiness on that and the bread on that i feel like it's going to taste very similar it just minus the cinnamon plus caramel and vice versa it smells very caramelly care of mel i don't know why who mel is or why we're going to take care of him but it's all right it's i don't right. know if i put enough creamer in there yeah uh, it's white. You put enough creamer in there. White. I can tell right off the bat it's, it's sugar, free. sugar free. Yeah, it's. I don't know that. So I think the issue here is that sugar free and caram caramel sugar free is not a good flavor because it's lacking like the creaminess of which I don't know. That doesn't make sense, but that's what I'm going with. It also has like the whatever the original coffee creamer. Yeah. That's what I'm getting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Just some of that in there. And I can taste a little bit of the caramel, but I mean, if we go back to like... To that, yeah. This kind of tastes like a... has like a citrus taste to, it, to me. It's just because it's weak. Like, the sugar-free stuff tastes weak. And that's... I think that's the problem. This is very rich and creamy. And it's the difference of just the sugar. It's not like it's dairy-free versus non-dairy-free. It's just... Well, that's... this has a milk derivative. Isn't life a milk derivative though, if you really think about it? Guys, you should get the caramel pop tart. If you find the Twix that's not sugar free, I would I would try. If like if we find this that's not sugar free, I'll probably grab it and try to try to try to try it. Try to try to try to try to try See what sugar free will do to you, kids? Stick with sugar. Ignore what your parents say. Have a good one.